Hi, Lee Phillips again. Yeah, it's me. I've had the question, what's the difference between a grantor of a trust and the trustee of the trust? Well, you've got to ha have some terminology here. The grantor is the guy who sets up the trust. And the lawyer will call him the grantor, the settlor, or the trustor. It's the guy that sets up the trust and originally puts money or property into the trust. So the grantor is the guy who sets it up. The trustee is the guy that manages it on behalf of a third party, the beneficiary. So the grantor sets it up, the trustee manages it in the trust for the benefit of the trustees. Now here's the hard part to understand maybe. And that is you can wear the grantor's hat you can also wear the trustee's hat and you also get to be the beneficiary. In your living revocable trust and the definition of a grantor trust in the IRS, and it's a special termino IRS terminology, the, the definition basically says that you're all three of these guys. And if you're all three of these guys, the grantor, settlor, trustor, the trustee, trustor, no, trustee, and the beneficiary, then the IRS says, we don't want to know about it. It's a grantor trust is the way they term it. So the grantor sets up the trust. The trustee runs the trust. They can be different people. They often are. Or they, in living revocable trusts, are almost always the same person. When you do your living revocable trust for your estate planning, it's going to be the same person, you, grantor, and you, trustee, and even you as beneficiary. So the difference between grantor and trustee is the same if you're the same guy. If they're different, they're very different people. And I can get a hired gun somebody to manage my trust for me. Banks love to do that. In the old days, it always used to be the first Cheatham and Howe bank and trust. And in the 80s, they decided that the trust was a little too stuffy, the bank and trust. Uh, and they wanted to appeal to the common person and trusts were for rich people. So they dropped the name trustee from the banks, but it always used to be the first Cheatham and Howe trust or bank and trust. And now we don't talk about banks being trustees, but they love to be trustees because they charge you a little money. So trustee, grantor, two different animals, two different hats at least, but you can be both or we can have different people be both or be one or the other, I guess, not both. All right, Lee Phillips. Now, don't forget to subscribe because we keep putting out new stuff and follow the links down below so that you can get more information on a lot of topics from Legalese and Lee Phillips.